Welcome to Checkmark Tutorials. In this video I will show you what is all my links, how to use all my links and at the end of the video I will also show you quick overview of the all my links mobile application. So for anyone out there that is not familiar with uh, this online tool, all my links helps you to combine Instagram, Twitter, YouTube and website links into one profile page. This tool allows you to create a profile completely free of charge and your own profile page is ready in seconds. Or as they themselves put it on their web page, link your Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, YouTube or any other website, create your links or profile in seconds 100% free as they say it. And also you are in complete control. There are never any ads on your profile, which is awesome I think. So in order to start, you have to first create an account so in order to do that, go over here to sign in, sign up for allmylinks.com. Here you have to insert your name, email and password. If you have a brand or business name, just insert business name. If you don't, insert your real name. If you fill out these forms, then simply click sign up. You can also sign in with Twitter, Facebook or your Google account. And now select your unique username that will be added to your URL. So just insert it and then click continue. Here you can quickly add your first links. So let's say Facebook, go over to your Facebook, copy the link to your page, go back to all main links and just paste it here. Do the same with all of these others. So now I added only these three links to start and keep in mind that you can always add more links later to any platform or web address that you desire. Then press save. And now this is your profile. And as you can see, my links has been appeared here. There you can see, here you can edit your profile, there you have settings, here you can add some links, so for example click here and here you have popular, so you can add web link, discord, any social media that you can really think of, or you can search for it right here. You can also have payment links, so Cash App, Venmo, Paypal, Patreon and other. You can start a campaign, so you can crowdfund something and also add a paid link. Then you have contact links, so you can add your email, phone, SMS and WhatsApp. Then you can close this. And now up here you can see you have home here. So here in home you can see your bookmarks, notifications and even messages. All my links have this private messenger, so you can message to anyone. This also happens to be the same tab that is up here. So I will go back to home and then to my profile and here you have your QR code so when you click on this as you can see this is your QR code to your links you can download it print it or customize it so click on customize and you have really a lot of customization here you can even add your own image cover gradient change colors and just browse through these options and you can see that there is a really lot of customization with your QR code which seems unnecessary, but it's nice to have it. So if you want to make it look a little bit prettier, you can change your profile picture, your banner, also your bio and description. And I will show you right now how to do that. Go over to edit profile, click on that, and then it will send you to profile settings. Here you can update your banner. So click on this icon and choose banner that you would like. You can change the scale of the banner right here. So I will make it big. Then click on preview and you should see it pop up right here. Then you can choose to save it. So click on save. And now in order to select your profile picture, click on pick an image right here. Upload from your device or load avatar from NFT profile. So I will upload from device, upload my profile picture and click on save if you are done resizing it. So let's say I will make it a little bit bigger, resize it and then click save. You can always remove image right here. Then you can change here your full name or, or your username and your team color. So as you can see now it's blue, everything is blue. So I will change it to green of course. This is better. So here you can change your background page. Just go here and then search for your background. Here you can write 160 character short bio which is very important to have, so make sure that you have written it. Then update your description here in about page. So here you can write a lot of text about you. And then you can choose to display your birthday on your profile. So check this, pick an year. And you can also change your gender. So 
make your gender visible on your All My Links page and choose your location. You can also show view count on your profile by ticking this box and then don't forget to save it right here. So all of your changes will be saved when you click here. Settings successfully saved as you can see. Then go over to security. Here is the place where you can change your password so don't forget about that. You can also set up two-factor authentication here. Go over to profile widget now and this is your HTML code of your profile widget and this is how it looks. Then you have manage links here and here you can manage all of your links. You can easily move them up and down with this arrow right here, however you would like it to be. You can also add category divider right here and enter a name. So let's say now I will do long form tutorials and I will move it YouTube down here. So there is short form, there could be long form and you can add this category divider whenever you like. Then you have analytics here. And then you have account settings down here. Here you can verify your email address. You can even block visitors by country. So you can select this and block visitors from a certain country as it is in the example. So if you add Canada, then no one in Canada will be able to view your profile. You can also block individual US states. So as it says Florida, for example, down here you can connect your account. So let's say you want to connect your Google, Facebook, Twitter or Instagram, you can do that right here. You can also connect your custom domain or subdomain that you own to your All My Links profile. Set up all of these three steps and you will be fine. Here your domain and down here you can delete your account. Under account settings you have also messages. So we have been here before. This is settings for our messages. So we can allow or disable messages from certain users or send a welcome message to everyone. After that you have notification settings. Here you can enable push notification and email notification and lots of customization here about your email notification. You can even select email frequency by hourly, daily or weekly. Then you have payouts right here and you can set up which way you want to accept payments. So let's say you have option to PayPal here. Payments down here. Here will be displayed all of your product payment uh, purchases and your payments. So go over here to your profile and click on my profile. And as you can see, this is how category divider looks. And you can add really a lot of links and customize this to your liking. Take your time to customize it because this is important. So your audience know that this is professional and they can purchase your products and trust you. Here you can see the profile count that we have enabled is right here. And then one of the last thing I want to show you is go up here and here you can go over to settings as we did before, but change your language. This is important. If you are from different country, change your language like here. Here you have help. If you struggle with something, you can log out right here or change your team to night like this and change it back to day like this. Then the last important thing, click here to copy your link. And as you can see, your link has been copied. Then you can go over to another page, command V and paste your link. And this is how it will look. And you can also share this link, of course, on your social media and other applications and with people. And now I will show you a quick overview of mobile application All My Links. So when you are on your mobile device, go over to Play Store and search for All My Links, your link in bio application. Click on install when you are on it. And now once your application is done installing, just click on open and open the application. And now you can really quickly sign up Select all images with bridges or anything that reCAPTCHA will ask you to confirm that you are not a robot and then hit sign in. And now once you are here, as you can see, it is basically a simplified version of web application, all my links. So you have your home here where you can easily manage your links, bookmarks, where you can manage your bookmark links, notifications, and also the messages. And here, when you click on your profile, you have all the same things, change your language, Go over to your profile and customize it however you would like it to be and you basically see how it will look on mobile phone when you send it to someone or post it on social media and your audience comes through a mobile device i am really happy that you have decided to discover how to use all my links with me today and i really hope it was useful information for you and if that is the case then i would really appreciate you subscribing and hitting that like button because it really helps me to create the best tutorials for you guys 
You can also support me with donation link through PayPal. Link is in the description. Thanks for watching. Keep on learning. See you next time.